Scotland, a beautiful land filled with enduring mysteries. Perhaps one of the greatest being the secrets of whisky making, passed down from generation to generation for hundreds of years. In the last episode, we saw how coopers transformed planks of wood into vessels known as casks that give whisky its unique flavour. However, before the whisky can be matured in casks, it must all be kicked off by the germination process. This is from Cask to Bottle, Episode 2. Hi, I'm Colin Hamden White, and I'm going to shed some light on these secrets. Not all whiskies are created equally. Some are aged for more than 50 years to achieve the desired taste and coloration, but they all start from the same source seeds. The process begins on a concrete floor where barley seeds are spread out and allowed to grow over the course of about six days to produce rootlets, which are turned every four to five hours to ensure they don't become entangled. During the germination process, enzymes will be created which will then convert the starch inside the barley into fermentable soluble sugars and this is what we're needing to make our whisky from. Most barley that we use is called concerto but we do others have others like Optic or Oxbridge, but those are the most common barley that's used here. Next, the seeds are heated from below by a kiln and dried out so that the rootlets fall off as they're not needed in the whisky making process. The, the barley is put up into that, you know, that kiln, the pagoda shaped roof. At Bolveni, where they still have a malt floor, they use a little bit of peat for a start and then anthracite, and they have the fires below where it's dried. The heat rises up, goes out in a shape like this to spread the heat out over the floor and then the heat will be extracted out through the pagoda roof at the top. That's how it's dropped. It's dried over a two day period. And during that time, the little roots that have grown, they drop off. We give away to farmers because we can't use them anymore here. It's the enzymes inside the barley seeds that are created by germination, which then converts the starch into fermentable sugars that whisky stillers are really after. And now the barley seeds have been prepared and they are sifted and ground down or milled, ready for the mashing process. Follow us from cask to bottle as we discover this and other mysteries of the whisky making process.